Hello guys, in this video I'm going to show you how we can easily install this router in 3 easy steps. So the model number of this router is the Tenda F3 and I purchased this from AliExpress. This is the basic interface of the router. It has 3 antennas, this one. And then this is the power port. This is the reset button. And then this is the three uh, LAN ports and then one one port so the first step that we need to do is to using the power uh, adapter we need to plug in the uh, adapter to the power port step two guys is using a LAN cable from our ISP providers. So this is my uh, ISP provider, the U Fiber. We need to plug in the LAN cable on the one port. So here is it has a uh, blue indicator here, wherein you can plug in the LAN cable. So this will source up or this will give up. Uh, internet to our router and then for the third step we need to proceed to our computer or using our mobile device to configure and set up this router so let's proceed for the third step we need to connect to our Tenda router so the Wi-Fi name of this router is Tenda EF16EO so just locate the Wi-Fi name here or the SSID. So once connected, you can now proceed to the configuration of your router. As you can see, I'm now connected. You just need your browser. So just input or type the IP address of the router. 192.168.0.1 And now... We are here on the dashboard. So as you can see, it says here internet settings and wireless settings. And then there are three different connection type. PPPoE, dynamic IP, and static IP. So if you're going to use the PPPoE, you just input the username and password from your ISP. But if you're going to use dynamic, you don't need to input uh, anything since it will be auto-connected. But if you're going to use static IP, you just need to input the necessary details from your ISP providers. And now, since uh, I'm just going to show you how we can easily set up this, we will be using the dynamic IP. So here, this is the default name of your router, Tenda EF16EO, but you can now change its name. So I just want to name it as like this. And then since the router do not have a default password, we can now input a new password for privacy and security purposes. Okay, so that's it. Just press OK. It says here the wireless has been connected. Please connect to Wi-Fi name free Wi-Fi. So okay, you just need to reconnect again to your router. Okay. So let's try to do some speed test so we can check what will be the internet speed of our router. Just type on your browser the speed test. So as you can see guys, the average speed, download speed of my Tenda F3 router is around 90 Mbps. And for the upload speed is 
around 85 Mbps is the average. Okay guys, that's it. That's how we can easily install the Tenda FE router. I hope this video helps you. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel.